I want to do an intro with these people talking. <laughs> what hurts the most is being so gross and having you walk away. Way they've gone. Hi guys, it's Sarah, and welcome back to my. I've been waiting for that intro for so long, and it goes blurred. Hi guys, it's Sarah, and welcome back to my channel. For today's video, as you can probably tell by the title, is my everyday makeup routine. I just want to put a disclaimer out there that I am no means a professional in makeup. I just kind of do what I want to do um, and it kind of works. So yeah, so with that being said, I thought we would do this video and I hope you guys enjoy. And yeah, this is the finished look. So it's a very cash. It's just what I kind of like wear every day for work and things like that. And I don't really go out there because I don't know how to do like all contour and stuff like that. So yeah, so let's get into it <laughs> so first of all we're going to prime obviously i've already moisturized washed my face all that stuff but yeah first we're going to moisturize now i did drop this in the sink the other before so i'm hoping there's no water in it but the primer that i use is the we sherry gripping primer and i absolutely love this stuff it works so well it's a bit awkward to like get out though like right? because it's kind of you've got to squeeze it but then you've also got to press it at the same time so i kind of just do it on my hand like this to get it out and it's <laughs> it makes really random so it sounds as well But like you don't really need that much. I've probably done too much there, but you don't really need much. And basically this primer is like, it dries sticky. So it grips like your makeup and makes it stay on your face a lot longer. It's all over TikTok. So it is very, very, very popular. But yeah, I thought I'd try it and I absolutely love it. So it's like one of my favorite items at the moment. So we're just gonna pop this all over my face. I have got to use this mirror here unless I literally can't see what I'm doing. So I just kind of rub it in with my hand, get it all over. I should probably clip my hair out of the way. Might have to get it whilst this settles. But yeah, I basically put it all over my face. I actually might need a bit more. I don't normally. But I think because I dropped it in the <laughs> the sink the other day. I mean, before. That's not working as well. But it normally doesn't do this. As you can see, it looks quite red on my face. That's a good thing. It doesn't show for your makeup. But it just helps keep your makeup on. And then it goes like really sticky. which is good because that means it's going to grip your makeup I'm going to use the tiniest bit more just on the side of my face I always get interrupted by dogs or people in these videos I apologise but it's hot so I'm not closing my window yeah i'm gonna go and find something to put my hair up and then i'm gonna wash my hands because it's gonna make me very sticky for the rest of the video so bear with me two seconds i'm gonna put this around my face i'm hoping that it doesn't get stuck to the primer i should have done this way before <laughs> but this is just what i would use to wash my face anyway I'm trying so hard not to get it on the primer <laughs> there we go that works so I turned into Minnie Mouse for the day. Right, <laughs> so we're gonna go, this is set, so it's kind of sticky on your face, as you can see there. So that's what keeps your makeup on. It helps grip your makeup to your face. So we're gonna go in with some um, concealer 
and the concealer that I'm going to use is the Revolution Pro. It's actually, I think it's an under eye concealer but I use it everywhere. And it's an ultimate radiant, yeah, under eye concealer but it works really well on your, your blemishes around your face as well. So I don't really use it for under eye, I just use it for like my blemishes. And it's like this, comes in this like little, with this little wand thing that you can put on. And it's just in this case here and yeah i use it every single day because i always have these horrible spots on my face like they're not as bad as what they used to be but yeah i just can't cope with going to work with them showing so i always just use this walk away I've got a really random song stuck in my head so what hurts the most is being so close oh my contact lens went dodge then what anyway I just kind of put it on like blemishes and redness and things like that like my face is like really mixed matched colour, it's so weird. Honestly, every time I film these videos, my sister messages me. What's she saying? Oh, it's nothing interesting. She can wait. <laughs> After we've put it on all the stuff that I want it on, I like the places, I will just go in with my trusted beauty blender and yeah, it needs don't judge, it <laughs> it needs cleaning. I am actually going to clean my brushes after I film this video. But to be fair, it actually looks worse on camera than it actually does in real life, but it's all good. And yeah, we're just going to dab, dab, dab that in. Everywhere. It's a blend, blend, blend. Just like this. Do, 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 do. Oh, I found a new artist, by the way. That's really, really good. He's really not, like, very big, like, at all. When I say not very big, like, nobody would probably know about him. Um, he, he pops up on my For You page on TikTok a few times now. So I took the time to listen. And he's actually really good. So I followed him, and he followed me back, and I told him. But it was so weird because, like, I literally went, went to tell my sister about him because like if you don't know my sister does run totally music and it's like look like upcoming artists she interviews and stuff like that and small artists and all that um so I literally told my sister I was like I found a new artist and she was like what's his name so I told it told her and she was like no way he followed me the other day and I don't even follow him so I told her that she has to follow him and check him out and she likes him and he's so good and I figured out as well that he actually knows Rob and Ollie so oh, you all need to check him out he is this is his TikTok if I can get it to focus that's his TikTok go follow him it's called Oliver I can't pronounce his surname so I'm not actually gonna I'm really rubbish at reading as it is but yeah, I don't want to pronounce his last name wrong. So yeah, we all need to go follow him because he deserves the love. And he's really, really, really good. And I've told him that as well because he is. <laughs> right, so I think that's all blended in. Now we're going to go into with some, blah, some foundation. So where is it? The foundation that I'm using is some Revolution Pro again. This is newish i got it a few months ago and i absolutely love it so it's cc perfecting foundation and it's moisture rich and it's spf 30 and i'm in the shade f3 so this is what it looks like i actually quite like the container it's actually really cool and then we're going to go in with a real technique brush which is probably not supposed to be used for foundation but i use it anyway oh it's actually a buffing brush but you know i like to break the rules sometimes and then i'm just going to put a pump 
on here and then dab it on my face. And then give it a little buffer in. Technically, you can use it foundation because you buff the foundation in. See what I did there? Anyway, yeah, so we're just going to go all over the face with that. Honestly, I have dogs and people interrupt this video, these videos so much that you guys are probably so used to it. I always make sure I go down the neck too. And then we just need a little bit more, the tiniest bit, which is probably still too much. Going on my face. Where it hurts the most. I don't even know why I've got this. I think it was on TikTok before when I was watching TikTok. It's being so close. But yeah, I always have. I always, always go down my neck because I don't want to look weird. I really need my eyebrows doing. I've been. I've booked in for to go get them done beginning of next month which i can't wait because they're stressing me out anybody ever get it where they can just see like that the brows coming through where they shouldn't be and it proper stresses you out because you know it shouldn't be there that hair but then you want to pluck it but then you don't because you know that you'll probably ruin them that is me right now anyway we're going to go in with some body shop powder I'm literally not replacing it until I've used it because I love this stuff so much. It's, I've broken it. <laughs> it's the, it's just a matte clay powder and it's in the colour 010 and it's a full coverage pressed powder and I basically just like to go over my face with it just because it sets kind of like the foundation and it's also like, it's not like translucent so it can get put a bit colour back into my face because it's a pale foundation that I use so I just kind of whack this all over mm -hmm. how's everybody been by the way I've not done a makeup video in a while I've done a get ready with me but that's different because this is an everyday makeup routine but yeah how's everybody been and also hi to new subscribers thank you so much for subscribing I really appreciate it I forgot to say I'm going in with the real technique contouring brush because I don't know how to contour, so I just use it for other things. Um, but yeah, so anyway, how's everybody been? How have you been up to much recently? I'm so, right, I'm so sad that I've not been to a gig for a bit. <laughs> I'm saying that. I went to one like two weeks ago, nearly. Two weeks on Saturday. But I'm just so used to going to gigs. I can't, I'm going to be sad when gigging season's not like over. But yeah, it is what it is. I'm excited for my next gig though. I'm basically just going under my eyes with this and not over the lid because I don't like putting liquid foundation on. So it kind of matches it in. I keep getting too close to the mirror and keep banging it. If that's what you wondering what is what. You are her and bang you. I can I like to try and buff it into my hairline as well so it's not just like this random orange line. If you can hear that as well, somebody coming into my flat block. I bet these are people that live in my flat block wonder who I'm talking to because they all know I live by myself. Right, what is next? I'm gonna set the face. My setting spray's not here. Bear with me. I actually don't know where it is. I found it. It was in the bathroom. <laughs> so the setting spray is my match to my <laughs> my primer, which is the the Wee Sherry. It's the hydrating dual phase setting mist. And again, it's a hit on TikTok. So if you've not seen it, I don't know what's going on, where you're living. You're living under a rock. Yeah, so we're going to use this. It is in this container. And they actually come in a duo. So I got these two together in a duo. So yeah. 
So we're just going to set the foundation and the sealer and the powder. So. I opened my mouth. But yeah, I love the smell of this. And it's, it like sprays that I've used. You can tell it's spraying on your face. But this is just so subtle that you don't even know it's on your face. Like when I'm spraying it, it doesn't even feel like it's going on my face. Which it is. I know it is because... I can obviously sense that my face is a bit wet right now but it's like it's just not heavy it's so subtle and the smell is amazing so I love this and I'm probably gonna forever use this because it's one of my favorite things I've ever got um but yeah so that is the setting spray that I use so obviously because this is an everyday look I don't go out there i never really go out there anyway but i don't go out there with makeup i just kind of use simple things and they're probably not right as it is i probably don't use the right things for the right like the right stuff for the right things but it's just it works for me so i'm just going to continue i can't speak today and yeah what is that oh a body shot i really need to go through my makeup because i've got so much old makeup in there Anyway, I'm basically just like stalling time for this to dry so I can do some mascara. But yeah, so let's have a chat whilst I'm waiting. It don't take that long, but I just thought, you know, we'll have a catch up. I know I had a life update video done last weekend, but yeah, and it's I've had so much love. So thank you so much. But yeah, thank you. And obviously, I just want to know how you guys are. So let me know. And yeah, <laughs> also like... Again, if you've got any certain videos you want me to film, let me know and I will film that. But yeah, I've not really got anything to update you guys on because obviously I did an update video last, last week. And yeah, <laughs> I keep saying and yeah. That's like one of my phrases is and yeah. <laughs> but yeah, so it's now, I've just done it again. I said but yeah instead of and yeah. But yeah. <laughs> anyway i'm gonna go in with some mascara i do really need to change my mascara i've had it for a while but i always look like i've got no eyelashes when i do makeup so i just put a tiny bit of mascara on to be fair this is a really good mascara i just need to replace it it's from the body shop and it's happy go lash and it just makes your lashes look so much nicer and it's in this really gorgeous packaging it's so pretty and yeah it's just this like little wand again i don't really do anything with my eyebrows by the way i just leave them natural but yeah you don't really need to put much on just to make it look like you've actually got lashes and i only ever do my top lashes as well because then it actually looks like you've got longer lashes than what you you have if you do your top lashes i never ever do my bottom so my old and my top but yeah and that is basically all i do for my everyday makeup routine <laughs> i'll put lip like what's it called not lip gloss <laughs> i put have i just knocked my mascara everywhere no i didn't i'll put what's it called lip balm i put lip like lip blah 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 I just malfunctioned i put lip balm on and that is basically the look that we go with and it lasts so that's what i do and it looks nice to me so yeah <laughs> so that is it that is my everyday makeup routine i don't really do much but you know i just thought i would share it because it's kind of like an update from one that i've done a while ago and yeah it's my makeup routine changes all the time so it's always fun to up do these updated routines but like i say i'm nowhere nowhere near being a professional makeup artist like i don't know how to contour <laughs> i know that says everything i don't know if i'm doing what, what i'm what i'm doing is right but it works for me so that's why i just do it but yeah so thank you <laughs> for watching this video if you've made it to the end of the video tell me your favorite makeup product because mine has got to be out of the primer and the setting spray setting spray that i use so yeah let me know your favorite down in the comments below and yeah thank you so much for watching if you're new to this channel and i've just appeared and you've watched it thank you so much but please 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 
hit my subscribe button if you are new and give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it because I really really enjoy making these type of videos and I enjoy watching them as well to see if there's any new makeup products I want to try. I apologise if you can hear talking, I always get interrupted. But yeah, thank you so much for watching, I really appreciate it. And I'll see you next week with another video. Bye!